so really quick, uh, I spent about uh, 45 minutes. Um, there's a lot of good information in the visitor center. Uh, there's a lot of art, uh, paintings, sculptures, ceramics, etc. There's uh, photographs. There's uh, some information um, about the sculptor and about Crazy Horse. Um, they had a really cool portion of it is that, um, they have the sculpting information, you know, the, how difficult or, or the different steps, how much detail has to go in making the face. Um, and in that uh, building, they have this kind of like little area where the the remnant rocks from the sculpture they I guess they drop them off there and you could take a piece I saw a guy walk off with like a huge head-sized boulder I don't know what he's gonna do with that exactly like I can't I took like a tiny little piece and I you know and I I'll probably put it in a drawer and you know kind of be like oh yeah I remember that but I can't imagine what he's gonna do with this giant rock hopefully he doesn't have a significant other because they're gonna be like no leave it outside so um who knows maybe he's gonna he's gonna bring the the pet rock fad back to life i'm not sure um but yeah all in all um this i felt i definitely enjoyed this more than mount rushmore i uh, gonna drive to wind cave now